Hello, hello, and welcome to the last Disneyland Paris vlog of the trip. So, so sad. So, so sad. Our Eurostar is at 5.09. Um, and, yeah, we're really sad to be going. But it's been an amazing trip, and we still have most of a day left. So, it's not too bad. We are, like, doing a little bit of packing right now. But we are going to head down for breakfast, quickly go and make our last magic, early magic hours. Um, come back, pack completely, check out at 11. We're going to leave our stuff just down here um, at our hotel, go and enjoy the rest of the parks. And then come back about 3-ish to get our stuff because we've got to be at the Eurostar for 4. But yeah. So come with us and come and see our last day at Disney. So change of plan. We are just going to check out now because we got ready and packed a little bit quicker than we thought we would. So we're just going to check out now. And yeah, head to the park. So let's go. Bye, Ruby. Get the light. Get the light. Two one six. Sad times. <laughs> I just see what I look like. We are now entering a rainy Disneyland. I've decided, or we've decided, that it's Disney crying because we're leaving. Sad times. I look like a, a weather person. <laughs> a weather yeah, woman. A rubber, <laughs> a rubber duck, thanks. But I'm not getting wet. I've only just washed my hair this morning, so I'm not getting wet. But, yeah. Sad times. So... I don't know if you guys know, but most of the rides in Disneyland, or not most of them, maybe, I don't know, the majority of them are inside rides. Yeah, apart from the one that we're planning on doing this morning, which is RC Racer, which is outside. Fab. But hey-ho, raining in Disneyland is better than raining at home, at work, or whatever. So, we can deal with it. But yeah, we're going to go in, walking into Walt Disney Studios now. Um, yeah, I'm getting it, getting the cord out. Yeah. Hello! <laughs> we're getting into a Walt Disney Studios now to go on RC Racer and then we're going to head over to Disneyland Park, take some pictures of me jersey with the castle and maybe do a buzz. But yeah. <laughs> Time is 8.40pm. The park opened 10 minutes ago. This is the line for Crush's Coaster. That is Insane. Literally, this is a line. So, RC Racer is closed for technical issues, so we are going to go on Hollywood Tower of Terror. I think this makes it like the fifth time? Fourth or fifth time, but we think fifth. But hey, we love it. So, RC Racer is still down. Um, so we popped over to Rock and Roller and we did that real quick. That was like 15 minutes away, which is cool. Um, but yeah, it's still down now. So we're going to head over to um, Disneyland Park, see if we can do buzz and just a few other little bits and bobs. We just bought a little Groot from um, a shop inside the Walt Disney Studios like walkway. Um, and we also did, there's like a little um, photo machine there. So we took uh, a little photo there, which is quite cute. Oh look, here's Groot. He's like the snuggle one, so his arms open. And then, there you go, look. His arms open and give you a cuddle. <laughs> He's so cute. We looked at him for like days. Um, we were like, oh, should we, shouldn't we? But today we decided we're just gonna get him. I think he was um, 17.99. Um, 
but maybe after this vlog series I'll do a little oh they lost my coat I'll do a little um, Disneyland Paris haul so you guys can see all what we've bought but yeah we're gonna exit now and then go to Disneyland Park so I have changed into this gorgeous Minnie Mouse jumper and um, we come over to the park we took some pictures in front of the castle with my spirit jersey which I won't set here um, we then I then got changed into this jumper because now show your jumper we got matching jumpers on uh, both from the Disney store in the UK um, so we got changed and then we took some super cute pictures together in front of the castle which I'll also insert here um, we got a fast pass for Buzz um, the wait time was only uh, 20 minutes but we thought we'd get a fast pass for it anyway the time is 10.50 and the fast pass is for 11, 11.20 to 11.50 um, so now we're going on Hyperspace Mountain which will make four times um, the wait time for this is only 15 minutes so we're doing great it's like all the wait times in yeah like Kevin said by the time we're finished here should be time for buzz um, but it's like all the wait times in Walt Disney Studios are really really high and then here they're all green so I ain't complaining so we just got off hyperspace amazing as always um, we've just checked wait times uh, it's gone insane again Tower of Terror guys 115 minutes 115 like I thought the highest that I've ever seen before was yesterday or the day before when Big Thunder was 100 minutes no Tower of Terror is 115 minutes insane and then I think Matter 2 is 80 um, there was another one that was also read it was Disney Studios um, and then what's highest here 95 minutes for um, Big Thunder Mountain and the time is only quarter past 11 yeah yeah quarter past 11 insane it's because the rain's cleared up guys it's because no longer raining so we just did buzz and guess who won not me kevin won but i think it's like 4-1 now yeah but he literally smashed me <laughs> he actually smashed me i think you got That's over like over 100,000 100, i think i was on like 8,000 or something like 80,000 but yeah he smashed me <laughs> but it was still fun i loved it um don't actually know what our plan is now to be honest but we seem to be heading towards the castle oh casey jr <laughs> we're gonna go through the castle and then we're gonna go to casey jr after and the uh, fairy tales oh and the storybook fairy tale ride too so yeah, it's kind of quiet, weirdly. But the ride times are huge.
and went on the storybook thing. Um, we saw Snow White meeting with a dopey. We saw Princess Aurora and her prince. Um, also meeting just like opposite um, storybook place, the ride. Um, and then walking round to Princess Pavilion. We were just sitting there and we waited for Ariel to come out for her break. Um, got a nice little wave from Ariel, which is cool. And we also saw Snow White and JP going off for their break. So we got a nice little wave and kiss from them too, which is cool. Um, but yeah, so now we are just um, doing our last, our last, our last ride, which is going to be Hyperspace Mountain. Going to do our last ride. We're going to go say goodbye to the castle. And then we are going to go into Disney Village, get some stuff from the shops, have a little bit of lunch, and then go back to Newport Bay for the last time to pick up our suitcases, and then come back up here to go to the Eurostar station. Sad, sad times. Time to say goodbye to the castle. Bye, castle. Main Street for the last time. Bye, Main Street. Guys, so as you know, we're walking down Main Street, got to the bandstand, and Mary Poppins and Bert were meeting there. Um, yeah, so we went to where the parade ends because we figured out when they went for their break yesterday, that's where they go, and they only had one person left. So we thought we'd go and wait for them there. I'm going to insert the video after this. But um, yeah, Bert and Mary, they stopped to give us everyone a little wave. And Bert remembered us. Like, how cool is that? He actually remembered us. So that has been like the icing on the cake of this Disney trip. So, so cool. <laughs> I want Disney Studios. So we are currently in Earl of Sandwich. Um, I have ordered um, a cannonballs sub with apple juice right here and a brownie which comes quite cutely uh, and then Kevin has ordered the 
Philly cheesesteak. He had wedges. Just there. And then he's also got his beer. Um, we're going to quickly eat here before heading back to the hotel. It is absolutely pouring down. Don't know if you guys can see, but yeah, it's pouring down. But it's fine because, I mean, we're on our way home, so we're not going to be in it for too long. But we do have to walk back to our hotel, so hopefully it does die down. Um, but yeah, the meals came to, so my one come to 13.40 and Kevin's came to 16.40 because I think, um, I don't even know his wedges, ah, uh, the beer, the beer was 6.50, the sub it's on its own was 6.95, so the beer is almost as much as the sub. But yeah, so if you are thinking about eating here, that's roughly the price, the sandwiches are roughly 6.95. Uh, depending on what you get. I think you can go big. Oh yeah, $6.95 or you can have a bigger one for eleven fifty. Salads and wraps are $7.95. So there you go. If you're thinking about coming to Ella Sandwich, that's the prices. I'll show you guys our food when it comes. We've got these little buzzers here to tell us when our food is ready. It's not ready yet. So it comes. Cannonballs. Open it up. It's really hot guys. And we are officially back in England. Very, very, very sad times. <sighs> what can I say? We had a fab, fab trip though. What have you forgot? Oh, the escalator has stopped. <laughs> um, yes, we had a fab, fab, fab trip. It was really, really good. Um, after this video, there will be a trip review, there will be a restaurant review, there will be um, a Disneyland Paris haul, like there will be a couple more videos to come, so don't worry guys, there's going to be more Disneyland Paris stuff. Um, but I just want to say thank you guys for tuning in to my vlogs, um, I hope you've enjoyed them as much as I have making them, and yeah, I hope you guys like coming along and sharing the experience as much as you could with me. Um, but like I said, there will be more vlogs coming relating to this trip, so don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> but yeah, please, as always, like, comment, share and subscribe, and I will see you in my next video.